Hey, welcome back to our hungry adventures. Guys, in today's video we continue exploring Lanta Island of Krabi province of Thailand. And I've got a question for you. Is it possible to find decent budget accommodation right on the beach here on Koh Lanta? Because there are quite many fancy resorts with modern facilities, new furniture, nice swimming pools and so on. But what about us budget travelers? Can we find something affordable by the beach? Because we just need a clean room with soft bed, air conditioning and windows. Am I right? Ah, and I think I found a place. Check it out. Well, this room is not that big, but it's pretty clean and there is no strange smell. Here is the fridge, television, windows, and you want to have nice windows when you're traveling in the rainy season, trust me. Here is the bed, it's pretty soft. It's very soft because there is some new fancy mattress, which is really good. And this room cost only 600 baht a night, right on the beach, man! I can stay in bed, look at the window and see the seaside. I'm extremely satisfied and extremely hungry. Let's find something delicious. Let's go! Guys, quite often I see in the comments that besides nice music, amazing locations, beautiful drone flights and funny conversations with locals, you're also enjoying smooth footage of my videos. And indeed, the majority of them are being made with a camera stabilizer, with a gimbal. And for the past couple of years I've been using this one, it's called Gion Weeble S. It's strong, not expensive, reliable, and I've crossed half of India with it, I've explored Nepal and Myanmar with it, and how many videos we've made together in Thailand, I really lost count. And since I'm holding it in this hand right now, it means there is something different stabilized my camera at this moment. Please meet and greet the very new GUNB Build 2. It is a small, compact and lightweight gimbal, which is simply ideal for travels and adventures. And I want to thank GUN company for sponsoring this video and for supporting this channel. They sent me this stabilizer a couple of weeks ago, and I've been testing it since then. Actually, three previous videos have been made with We Build 2. And I gotta say, this tiny giant is really brilliant. It's really compact, I can easily place it into my backpack and explore jungles, caves, beaches with it. Its weight is only one and a half kilogram, so you can take it anywhere with you. Webuild 2 has a new fantastic design with even more comfortable grip. Back handle has a new quick release system, so you can pop it on and off quite easy. Its new locking system allows you to set up your gear and start filming within few seconds. Weevil 2 has a new built-in battery which has a runtime of up to 9 hours and which you can fully charge in about 1.5 hours. There is a new flip-out screen right on the gimbal where you can access all its settings or even connect your camera to this screen using Geon Video Transmission Transmitter. And you also can use this transmitter to connect your camera with an external monitor. Besides that, all the buttons and joystick have been moved from the back and placed on the left side, which allows to grip the gimbal much better and still being able to easily operate all the settings. Its stability has been significantly improved, it provides even smoother performance, and I could tell you so much more about its features. But you better check out the link in this video description to learn more about G and Weevil 2, while I'm going to continue filming our adventure with it. The link is down below, please check it out! Tini alai aloi chisut. Alai aloi chisut. 
Ay. Wala pong may may kay ma, may kay ma. First time. Ay. Wala pong duty ko gan. Mi review yo 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 to compute o oh, tini ahan aloy aloy tisut na ikolanta. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So what do we have today? This one is masaman curry with chicken. This one is deep fried chicken. Deep fried chicken legs with special sauce and sesame seeds. And this one, I think I'm trying this one for the very first time. This is some tam tot. So let's start with curry. Mm. Mm. All these flavors, such rich flavors, lots of chicken, carrot, some vegetables. Mm. Very thick sauce. Mm, smells magnificent. My apologies, I'm eating chicken with my hands. Mm. Tender meat, thick sweet sauce, slightly spicy. It was born to be eaten, to be eaten by me. Mm. So what about this one? It looks like classic somtam, somtam Thai. But green papaya was fried. And the taste... It's just like french fry, but it's not potato, it's green papaya. Lovely! Love all of them, I can't decide which one is better. All of them are really great and probably tomorrow I'll come to eat in the same restaurant again. Mm. Where? Where is this? Fire!
So what do we have today, guys? Mm. Fried rice with shrimp served in a half of pineapple. It smells fantastic. And this one, huge bowl of noodle soup, yellow bami noodles with seafood. These are squid, mussels, prawns, crab, few slices of lime, and half egg and some mushroom. Uh, <laughs> eating this soup while wearing white t-shirt. Dangerous game. <laughs> yeah. When you're traveling to the south of Thailand, you need to be ready to eat really spicy food. Mm, spicy, but extremely tasty. Wow, wow, I gotta say wow. Mm. Now let's try the mussel. Extremely fresh. Yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Everything is extremely fresh. Mm. This restaurant has so many nice reviews, which is why I've come here. And now I know why. My food, my food, ninja fly. Let's try this one. Oh yeah, ah, oh, I can see some cashew. Mm. This is some kind of biryani rice. I can feel the flavor. It just melts in your mouth, in my mouth. Raisins, carrots, cashew. Mm. Beautiful meal. What a great start of the day, even though it's raining again. Bye bye.
Ooh. What's up guys, please come in. Welcome to Peaceful Resort, which indeed looks quite peaceful and quiet. But initially, I haven't planned to stay here, because this place is located right next to the resort I've stayed a few days ago. You remember it in the first video about Kolanta. But since it's been raining pretty hard and I need to show you something new, I have decided to come and check it out. And it looks pretty amazing, man. It is considered as one of the most comfortable budget accommodations by the beach here on Kolanta. And it's quite popular with international travelers. If you've ever been to Kolanta, you might have stayed here, maybe in the same house. And yeah, I've paid just 500 baht for this house. They call it Pool View Bungalow. Here is the pool, here is the bungalow. Pool View indeed. While rooms behind me are a bit cheaper. And the beach is just in 200 meters away. There is just two minutes walk. Same beach I showed you in the previous video. And like I've mentioned, it's been raining pretty hard, and to, even today the sky is fully covered with rainy clouds. It's pretty dark, pretty sad, pretty dramatic. Jungles, beaches, my face. Which is why I think we can use my time travel machine and jump into the future. Oh yeah, I've got time travel machine. And I just need to snap my fingers to jump into tomorrow. Check it out. ที่นี่อะไรอร่อยที่สุดครับฟอร์มกินแพดได้ใช่ฮะพวกกริ๊งพวกกริ๊งพวกกริ๊งกัวกริ๊งภาษาอะไรพวกกริ๊งเต้า
Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the new day. New sunny day, new burning hot day. Even though it was raining pretty bad just 24 hours ago today, you just can't stay outside, yeah? And today we are tasting authentic Southern Thai food, finally. There are quite many restaurants on Kolanta, but majority of them serve kind of touristy food, food for foreigners and so on. But this place, called Kruadan Thai Restaurant, serves authentic Southern Thai food. Here we've got omelette cooked with uh, by Liang with Malenjo leaves, real food of South. This one is boar meat, not pork, real boar meat cooked with herbs and uh, curry paste. They cook curry paste here every day by themselves. They don't buy it outside, which means it's gonna be really tasty. And this one is pork with lemongrass, with other herbs, with peppers, with chili, and etc. I can't even pronounce the name of this meal, the name of this dish. But this is real food of South. Lots of vegetables, cucumbers, green beans, winged beans, and this is for you. Let's start with this omelette. Mm. Phenomenal. Really fantastic. Buonissimo, signora. Oh. Очень вкусно. Beautiful, and it's completely not spicy. But these two, these are going to be really spicy. And guys from this restaurant, they said that this is the menu of Prince of Thailand. Some time ago, when he been here in Pimalai restaurant on in Pimalai resort, he ordered the same meal. So we are trying something really fantastic today. All right. Yeah, this is real this food of salt. Woo. Extremely spicy with many herb, like different kind of aftertaste with many different herbs. Wow. I gotta try one more, but this time I gotta try it together with rice. <sighs> Wish me luck. This boar meat is so tender, beautifully cooked, but it's pretty spicy. And they brought me some more, uh, what is it, fish sauce or vinegar with chili, in case it won't be spicy enough. <laughs> so kind of them. Oh man, start thinking about Titanic when you're eating spicy food. Oh, don't cry, man, don't cry. I think I've burned everything inside, so now I'm afraid I won't be able to, to feel the taste of this one. Luckily we got some vegetables. What to do with this one? Let's try to eat the top. No taste at all. So many herbs and so much of chili. Oh, real chili, dried chili, peppers. Oh, Probably this is just lemongrass, chili and pork. And some other ingredients like curry paste. But it's fantastic. Oh, and I'm sorry guys that I haven't showed you much of nature in this video because it's been raining pretty bad. So it turns out there is nothing to do when it's raining hard, except eating and staying in hotel. But it's still not bad, I'm not complaining. It was really nice time. But since it's a good weather today, we are having a chance to enjoy sunset. 
sunset, cheap hotels, delicious food, and lovely beaches. That's the recipe of nice holidays on Kolanta. It was really amazing, what a fantastic performance! Ah, this is the reason to fall in love with Kalanta, to fall in love with Krabi and Thailand, those fantastic sunsets. Even though it's raining from time to time, it is worth it. And I hope you have enjoyed this video, and if you have, hit the like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Turn the notifications on so that you won't miss the new videos, that you won't miss the live streams. And I'll see you in the next video pretty soon, somewhere else by the ocean. Bye-bye. Wow. <laughs>